Hello everybody, my name is Jacob, aka Jacoby04. And I'm Ellie. AKA Ellie Lou. And that's my that's my horse. Um you may be wondering why I'm walking he, I'm here already and I have a horse walking into a wall and here already means the flight range. I'll explain that in a bit, but for now, let's watch this. It's totally good quick. Oh yeah. That's right. This is Teba, the guy that we talked about. Uh, I'm sure it's Teba. Teba. I'm actually pretty busy here. You should probably go. I really like this guy. I really like his voice and his demeanor. Okay. And his design. He looks cool. Way cooler than the old champion. We just spit on my controller after eating lemon head. <laughs> All right. So Ellie's going to go ahead and explain no, why I cook some things. Go oh, you're gonna I'm going to cook things first. Oh, okay. So we started recording this episode, and um, we had some good news and some bad news. Um, and the bad news was that um, when Jacob was starting up the Wii U earlier, uh, he got... This a, episode. This episode. It was a very disappointing message. Um, basically, his Wii U has this issue that when it updates... He, um, it's happened on some other games where you can no longer play the game. Um, so it finally happened on this game for the first time. It was while he was in the menus, the uh, yeah. event, the adventure log. So um, we were really hoping that he'd be able to get through this Let's Play before that happened. And it looks like maybe that's not going to happen. So our plan now is to do a... Um, speed run, basically, uh, to finish up this Divine Beast, and then head for Ganon. And so, right now, Jacob's cooking a lot of food, because he needs to be prepped for Ganon, basically right after this. Um, and if there is time afterwards, and his Wii U is still working, then after he defeats Ganon, we'll go back and do the memory quests. That's a pretty damn good summary. Um, so yeah, before I wanted to go talk to Alderito, to do side quests, go to the Divine Beast, Go do memories, go do a couple more shrines, and then call it a wrap. Now it's pretty much like uh, we got to be straight A, B, C, doing the exact important things in order, which sucks, but it's just how it is. So right now it's just straight to the Divine Beast, straight to this guy as quick as we can, and then right after that we're gonna go and vanquish Ganon. And then if we have time, then you know if my Wii U is still working, if my computer's still working, um, we're gonna head out and we're going to take on. Then we'll then we'll go do the captured memories. I want to do my goal. Ideally, if things will hold up, is to do all main quests before this is done. Side quests, shrine quests, whatever little diddly things I can I can live without. But you know, it, it, it's breaking my heart here. This sucks. I put a lot of time and effort into this, and I know not as much as like maybe other people put into their let's plays and whatnot. But I'm a real person, like like I've advertised since the beginning. I'm just a regular Joe guy playing a game that he loves and trying to have a little bit of fun with it while recording it. Um, so it's really, it sucks. And so while we started recording the episode the second time after it crashed the first time because of system memory, it then crashed again because of my computer having the crash again. So fate is just really not on my side right now. So I am uh, doing what I can, doing what I can, right? Yep. Um, so... I need to get some food made real bad because, you know, there's about to... Ideally, I'll just be able to... I'm basically making a bunch of plain foods right now. Um, disc space looking good. If you see Allie leaning over, she's checking out disc space. But now maybe it's time to talk about the good news. Drum I roll. Did, I did mention that there was good news. And the good news is... Drum roll. Tomorrow's my birthday. Tomorrow's Ellie's birthday. Happy birthday, so Ellie. we're celebrating, Jacob. We're celebrating. We're celebrating. <laughs> I'm sure that was obnoxious for anybody watching this on YouTube. Just just terrible. Sorry. Sorry. That's why I get this birthday hat because the store. The birthday, didn't it's a party have, hat. The store didn't have any party hats, so this is the nice party hat. The best party hat, you mean? Right. She's Link, she's the most important person in this game and in my life, and so she that's where she's at. Um, so this is pretty great. Um, so yeah, but we're happy. To, we're still happy to be here. We're gonna make yeah. the best of it. If the let's play fails, you know, I'll. I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna suck, but I'll, I'll get over it. Um, you can just 
just play it live for me. Just stop your crying, it's a sign of the times. Yeah, that type of thing, really. I've got tons of good food still, now so that's why I'm just making a bunch of... Your video. I know, right? For, for copyright, copyright, because it's just so accurate. Um, I want to make a couple of speed foods while I'm here. That's the last thing that I want to make. So where's my, where's my, where's my quick things? Where's my quick things? Rush room. Uh, let's add two rush rooms. Ruh -roh. Ruh -roh. It sounds like Copper trying to say mushroom. Mushroom. Woof, woof. Where is a quick fish? Where is a quick thing? I'm looking for anything. Swift Violet probably is fast. Oh, the son of a butt. I accidentally clicked the stop holding things button. All right, brush room. Um, and then you the obviously want a bird egg, <laughs> not a prime bird. Why do I want a bird egg? You want to fly fast. <laughs> yes, you are right. Um, and uh, let's do another swift violet, and let's do. I, I only have one bird egg, so I'm gonna yeah, save it. True. Let's let's do a bird thigh. Mm, I'm all about those thighs. There we go, another another speed up. Movement speed, plus movement speed, plus another movement speed, plus a prime mean. I bet this one will be good. I'm calling it. It's a two... Okay, it was one of the worst of all the ones I made, but I, I don't care. I don't mind being wrong. Um, am I full? Is that it? I've got one more I can make. Oh my gosh, okay. You know I have to. I know, I know. Jacob, hurry, hurry. Time is up the essence. So, really, this 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 recording is always a ticking time bomb. Like, in in all senses. Like, I cannot understate how uh, much of a time bomb this Let's Play is right now. Um, you want to save before you do it? That's what I... So, the thing is, saving doesn't help if either the computer or the system crashes. Actually, if the comp system crashes, it's fine. So, um... How are we doing on this space? This space looks good. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the thing with this guy because clearly he's gonna have some sort of side quest, training quest for me. Spoiler alert: he does. We know, but you guys probably could have guessed that too because you're smart people. Um, Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, you're welcome, future Ellie. I know. Right? Uh, there's that arrow catching on fire again. And so I'm gonna go do this thing with this guy, and then then we'll save it before we go take on the divine beast. So let's go do it. Talk. Did you need something? I'm busy here. I can help you. Help me. Do you want to read one of their voices? You you read links. Okay. Help me with what exactly? Bob Meadow. Let me get this straight. Some random Hylian wants to help me bring down to find beast Bob Meadow. I'm not buying it. What's your name, stranger? I'm Link. Link, huh? Well, Link, I'm Tiba, but you already knew that. I'm guessing the elder asked you to come here and talk some sense into me. Am I right? That's right. Just like an elder to trust any fool wandering into town. Look, you seem like an alright guy, but let's make one thing clear. I forgot to read that. As a Rito warrior, I can't rest until my people are safe. There's only one way I'm going back to the Rito village. And that is? Hmm. Once Divine Beast Bobado falls from the sky? If, oh, it falls from the sky. Wrong inflection. If I have to kill Bobado, <laughs> so be it. Only then will I return to the village. Let's get started. Do I have the wrong one? <laughs> are you serious? Huh? Ha! Well, far be it for me to talk you off the ledge. But uh, it's as the Elder said, the only way to stop Divine Beast Bombado is to get inside it. Fat chance of that happening, there's no way we can set foot in Mado. Actually... So not only are you wingless, but you're brainless, too. Let me fill you in. The only people able to enter the Divine Beast are the five champions of old. And unfortunately for us, the rest of the Pyro, they all died hundreds of years ago. If it hadn't been for Ganon... Never mind, let's focus on bringing down Mado, one step at a time. If we approach Mado recklessly, its cannons will blast us out of the sky before we even get close. So I'm going to need to test you before I take you with me. We Rito warriors use an updraft in this ravine to hone our aerial archery skills. The updrafts are so strong here that a person could just open up a cloth over their head and float up easily. Wow, that's mm -hmm. convenient. Now let's see what you're capable of. You'll have to maneuver through the air to destroy five of the targets set up in this valley in three minutes. I'm ready. Then go destroy five targets with your arrows. Let's do this. Let's take the same route that we took last time.
Apparently they don't like you shooting that one from like the side. Uh, I missed one. Okay. Okay, come on back. Boom. Chaka laka 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 laka. You're a skilled archer. It's as if time stopped with every arrow you let fly. Yup. I've got to tell you, Link. When you first showed up, I thought someone was pulling a prank on me. But after seeing you handle that bow, I can tell you the real deal. You must have seen a battle or two. Hundreds of them. I believe it. Link, I feel I've heard the name somewhere before. Well, if you really want to help me bring down the bow, it's now or never. I'll get you into position so you can give it its cannons all you got. Inside that treasure chest is a bow that I've modified. Take it, and let me know when you're ready. Alright, uh, gotta go drop a bow. Try to stay out of the menus. Everything's against me. I'm dropping the golden bow, even though it seems neat. Because, whatever. It's only 24 after the attack up. I already checked that I had a picture of it. Um, <laughs> and there's another falcon bow, which was the one that I was already using. Good, so I still have my falcon bow out. Okay, um, and so we're going to go ahead and save and call this episode early. So, um, thank you all for watching another episode of Breath of the Wild. It's quick. These might be short and sweet as they come, but that's okay. Yep. As long as we make it I'm to the okay end. As long as we make it to the end. As long as my number one fan is okay with that. So, happy birthday to Ellie. Thank you. Um, and... Tune in next time as we take on the Divine Beast Bombado, which I'm pretty sure, by the way, I've either titled some of my episodes wrong or descriptive them wrong or called the last Divine Beast Bombado like seven times. So, Oops. whoops. Um, anyway, catch you all next time.